Spider-Man Homecoming clip. What's happening guys? Kiblo Ahmed out here. Joined with Jakob Bersh. Make sure you follow this guy on Twitter guys. Always got something to say, causing all sorts of controversy up in this place. Always. But guys, today we're going to react to the Spider-Man Homecoming movie clip that they released today. Uh, we've both come back from work, it's been a tiring day. Uh, I'm going to try and get these videos out to you by tonight. Hopefully. Work hard, man. But we're going to jump straight into this clip. This movie comes out this summer, isn't it? I think. Let me double check. It was, yeah. Uh, July, my God, man. Two, Two months, months, bro. We got, you know, and we just... We're getting flooded by all these movies, so I can't wait. Uh, we're going to jump straight in, man. Let's see how this goes. If this is a secret, this is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. I can't believe this is happening right now. <laughs> I, I gotta go. Hey, where are you going? Hey, Zendaya. Yeah. What are you hiding, Peter? Oh! I'm just kidding, I don't care. Bye. So good. Do you know what I love what they're doing with the, like, I think. Having a younger Peter Parker, like from school days, and having a bit more jokes with it, because yeah, you know that the past ones were so serious. Yeah, grown Uncle up. Uncle Ben. Stressed out. Uh, you know, money problems and the rest of it, and they just forgot how to have just general fun. It's true. I, I'm not, I was in Portugal last uh, two weeks ago, and I was reading, uh, I bought a Spider Man comic with me to read, and it was called Homecoming as well. And this story is about him in school, uh, sorry, as a teacher in a school he was in trying to, you know, inspire the youth. But he had probably one of the hardest battles he went through. And it was a beautiful story, story guys. So if you guys get the chance to read Spider-Man Homecoming, the comic book, you guys are going to love this to bit. This is true, powerful reading. Strength, determination, never giving up. And, you know, stuff that you can add to your life as well. Mm. Like, it was inspiring, man. Does it relate to the film? No, no. Oh, so okay, the film, bit... because they've started the film very at a younger age. He's going to be more fun, more comedy. I can see the humour in it already. Still exploring, still learning. Yeah, that's right. And, I mean, look, you've seen the Marvel Universe now, bro, man. You probably thought years ago, like, what the hell is this shit Kibler watches, bro? But you've got into it now. Yeah. You know, you slap it on now. Because if you see it on TV, you're like, you know. It's become part of our pop culture and the youngsters as well. It's true, actually. They love it. They love it. I like it a lot. What do you think of that little clip, man? That was funny. It's funny. You tiptoes in. Get, and get yeah, no one saw him. <laughs> Bang! Chunky Bat is there. <laughs> but uh, no, it looks great. Film comes out soon. Tom Holland, I think he's a great Spider Man. Uh, Tony Stark's in it. Robert Downey Jr. Oh man. It's going to be full on, and I can't wait to see how the universe is expanding. Because yeah. after Guardians of the Galaxy, bro. Yeah, and you know, I noticed they're being smart with the trailers. They're giving you bits and bits and little bits. Yeah, of course. But the film's going to be off the charts. Yeah, it's going to be moist. It's going to be moist. All right, guys. If you like this video, click on the like button, share the video with your peeps. <laughs> Let us know your thoughts, comment below guys. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button. Guys, one love, peace. Take it guys.